Hi guys, Hamza here and uh, welcome to my channel. I'm going to show you the simplest way how to use Photoshop to optimize your pictures that you're going to use online. So what we need is uh, just a few things. You just need to have your Photoshop open, which I have here. And at the same time, we should have the image somewhere that we are going to edit. So I already have a folder on my desktop called Optimize. So in this case, we are going to um, just have this picture, open it in Photoshop, and then we optimize. But before we need to see its specifications, uh, apparently this picture is over, this picture is 5,000 pixels in the width and 3,000 pixels in the height. It's up to 7 MBs. So uploading this picture, whether on our website or on your Facebook account or Instagram is really, really big. If you have many of these pictures of this size, they would slow down your website. So uh, the best would be having this picture below 1 MB. We could have it like about 100 KBs or about 200 KBs, something like that. What we need to do is basically open the picture with Photoshop, open with Photoshop which I have already open here on my desktop. So we have our picture here. We are not going to do any edits in this photo. So what we need to do is we just go to image, uh, image size and reduce this image size to uh, maximum 1000. I don't see a reason why we should have an image of over 5000 pixels and yet we are going to use it online. So you can say we reduce that to that size and then now it is maximum 1000 pixels here we just now have to go to file save for web whenever you're going to save a file that you're going to use online you just go to file and say save for web and then you save in jpg and then we have this so by now we have already uh, cut down the image from 7 MBs to 132 KBs and depending on where you're going to use it if it's for web this display is already good it's good enough to use um, if you want to increase on the quality then that will also increase on the image size so by changing that to you know very high we just have here 234 KBs I prefer to have it at uh, high so that we have it you know under 200 kbs and uh, still very usable so we can just save this and we are good to go optimize this jpg so we can just save so we now have one that is jpg 136 kbs when you open it that's how it looks like still really looks neat and clean there is no big difference there is no much difference from the original and uh, you can still use the optimized one on any platforms on social media and anything and you have reduced the image size way much compared to the original which was 7 mbs and now what we have is only 136 kb i hope this video helps you in your future uh, projects when uh, you're working with pictures and how to optimize them for use online so guys, I wish you well. I'll see you in my next tutorial.